Hello and welcome to some more uh, Transport Fever 2 gameplay. It's the European series and uh, today it's pretty much just going to be uh, get the trains out on the East Coast Main Line and fill you in on what I did off camera. About two more hours worth of, of work was done behind the scenes uh, and then we'll just sort of lay in uh, some parts of the Great Eastern Main Line and we'll, we'll get some buses going. You know, we'll shake things up a bit. Right, so, <clears throat> uh, I am going to start you on Leighton Buzzard. I know. It's a shocker. You'll notice, if the game wants to play ball, come on, come on, ball wants to be played, therefore you will do it. We have a multitude of lines. What are these, I hear you ask? I shall tell you. This is high speed one. This is the... Uh, East Coast, this will be the Great Eastern. Now the reason, HST, the reason I've done two standard tracks for the Great Eastern along with this uh, diamond crossing is because the amount of trains I'm going to be having on there, they're going to need two platforms because the Great Eastern is going to be such a vast uh, line. So I plumbed in the initial bits for High Speed 1 and then the initial bits for the Great Eastern. So I'll show you the Great Eastern to start with. Runs just over high speed one. This nice uh, viaduct we've got going off here. I do love a viaduct. The line then splits. So let me just uh, do this. So before I do camera, you'll see that it's two two lines in there, but it means they can then they'll come up here, cross into that platform or that platform depending on their uh, on their line. So, it will come over here, it will come over, it gives us a put in this, the signals. I have gone around this map and loaded everything in, but uh, I haven't actually come down to a lower level and loaded things in yet. So, until I do that, it's going to be really juttery. I should have done that beforehand, but there we go. Right, so, the, the, the intercity services will be passing overhead, because you've got Leighton Buzzard East. So, Leighton Buzzard is now served by two train stations. So if you're this side of town and you don't want to go to the big terminus to get a train, you can just come to Leighton Buzzard East and pick up the Great East of Main Line. And then we run up here. I'll explain the spur in a bit. I then have it so the line then splits, comes up, Crosses over, which I, I'm, I love how I got that to work. Then over. Still going over. Then works its way up to a level, as do these lines here, as everyone's taken the main road, into uh, Milton Keynes. And I hear you say, Train 56. What's Train 56? It's a regional rise 150. Now, again, you'll see here, I've got crossings on the go. I'm just doing that for effect. I'm probably not going to utilize them fully, but what I'm thinking is here that this line, and th this is my plan, this won't be the bulk, this won't be the big arm of the Great East. Well, no. No, it won't be. Won't, this won't be. Actually, yes, it will. This is the bulk arm of the Great Eastern. So it comes down to South and Ferrers, then goes to Chester, Shipson on Store, Bedford. Whoops a daisy. Uh, Margate, Interberic, Whaley Bridge. Uh, then it goes to Waltham Cross, and then will terminate at Cardiff. Really odd one. I've then got a junction line, which is this one here. I'm still trying to work out why I did that in the first place, but I'm sure I can make it work. My initial plan, I know why I did it, was because I was going to have a the, the branch line to Broke Upon Tweed from here. So there's direct trains. Actually, yeah. No, no, no. Yeah, because Broke Upon Tweed is going to be. You have to, if to go to Broke from Milton Keynes, you have to go all the way around to get there. Whereas that's just a direct route. And it's a uh, courtesy of this 150. Very nice. So yeah, that's that plan. Uh, the intercity line will follow that. This branch then uh, goes to Whitby, 
it then goes to uh, Twyford and then into Derby and then terminates in London that's my that's my plan with the Great Eastern as things stand but I also thought well instead of making this station uh, too busy I'd create a smaller station with the bus station as well then literally just have it as a branch line with a single train going to and from Berwick so if you want to go if you want to go straight from Berwick into say Leighton Buzzard and then get around the map you can do so by taking this or you can go for the more scenic approach then then we have I will, and I will come to that that will make sense in a bit we then have Chester I've been busy okay So you can see Chester's got the cross-country line, it's got the Trans-Pennine uh, platforms, it's got the East Coast platforms, and it's got the East Coast Express service there. Coming down from up a hill, we've got this big depot down here, just this standard depot at the back, which I will utilise. And that will just be for trains coming up, they can cross everywhere, I've got junctions all over the gaff. I'll also come to High Speed 1 as well. I've gone and played with all of this, so all of these lines are now conjoined. So you can get to any one of these through all of the lines. It's going to be a complete mess, but it's going to be totally, totally worth it. I then played with some of my assets I have in terms of rolling stock. And I thought I'd create this one just a bit short. So I've got four Mark Threes and then four 37s all just sat out here that will be doing their own thing. But you can see that I've had to keep that level to get those in. So then what I've done is any diesel trains I have can run out from here. Can come, It comes over the line, under the motorway, down here, in front of the station, bosh, onto that network, which works perfectly fine. And then with my intercity trains, again... Like they could come up and into the depot for servicing. They can come out and head down. And then, because it is just such a bloody big one, I thought I'd, I might be a bit uh, bit clever. And because depots have relatively slow speeds, I've got it so, say, these 37s and that one, they can come out, go around the depot, come into here, cross over... Maybe even go back into there, pick up something, come back out. You've also got that line there, which then hooks onto all of these. So it's all the Transpennine routes and the and uh, everything else. The East Coast Mainline, you can see actually uh, ducks under everything else. And we're continuing with the Transpennine theme. Let's go do that and go up. Right, I'm going to have to use the uh, the track bit for this one so you can see what my thinking is here. So I had one, and this will probably be where the 350s will go along. They come out, sharp dip, under, under the rest of the lines. I think I may have got away with that. Yeah, I have. And then goes sharp around the corner, basically a hairpin, up through here, under the motorway, to another station in Chester. It will probably it will get utilised. Both both stations will be used. I'm pretty sure of it. And then you see what I did with the other Transpennine route because you were there when I did it at Ross on Y. The other one then comes up, comes over with this gorgeous bridge, up onto this higher station which I think works really, really well. And this will be where the 68 Mark V sets come along. So that'll be utilised by that. This will be utilised by the 800 series. And I also thought I might try and be a bit clever. I want to try something different. You notice here, I've got to build a station. And look what I've named this bus stop, the Margate Valley Railway. So I'm going to... That's Chester North Holt, which app, which works perfectly fine. My plan was I was going to have like a little heritage steam mixed with diesel heritage railway. 
be a little short thing. Say, go to Shipton on store. It would then run into into Berwick, and then go to Margate into Pocklington. Just a nice, a nice simple one. I've not done anything else with it. I've literally plumped the station in, and I can get around to doing that at some stage. So, with this depot, I've got another line. Comes out through there, crosses into all of these, then has to run down here, across the actual main East Coast main line, then comes through South Woodham, where the line then diverges off. And that depot will service the Great Eastern Main Line. That, that, that depot will be the one servicing it. I think I've got it crossing for Express as well, yes. So the intercity and commuter trains will come out from this big depot, at Chester, I'll call it probably Chester West Depot or something daft, goes through Chester Station and along. Uh, and then, this is what I've got for high speed one. So I've got Ross on Y high speed station, just a, a generic network southeast one, the longest I can do. So all the high speed trains come out of Leighton Buzzard, and it's literally a straight run all the way down to the Ross on Y. If I do a go back a bit, you'll see I've got an elusive bridge for it. So the line starts basically here. I've tried, I think I'll keep it as level as possible for the most part. So it runs, basically runs level, and it just it's a massive bridge all the way across, up, up until you get to the crest of this. Keeps on going till you get to here. Small bridge there through the tunnel, and then bang, straight into Leighton Buzzard. Lovely job. And I've gone underneath the airport with a fancy tunnel, and that's where high-speed one ends. And now I can do high-speed one again at a later date. So I plumbed all those bits in. I've got, uh, I've now got a big bus station put here at Ross and Y for the train stations, uh, and then we're just going to run up to uh, to Hull, where I've gone and whacked in another large depot and had a bit of a play. Again, this can serve. This will probably just service the East Coast Main Line uh, in itself. I'm pro I don't know what to do with them. Those four lines there, but what I've done here, I've got some. T I've got two class twenties. I've got some 150s. Let's, uh, let's go this way and up a bit. So some 20s with uh, a complete Mark III rake. I've got some 150s. I've got some 166s of multiple lengths. I've got a load more 150s that are just sat here, just waiting to uh, to be used at some stage. But you see they've got light, red lights on at either end, so you can tell you can see they're in the depot, so they're not going to be uh, not going to be used. I'm really looking forward to uh, to utilising those. Now, what I do need to do is uh, get the East Coast Main Line set up. So I've got my trains sat in the depot already. I can't remember which one it is. I think it's in here. Uh, train depot... Du, 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 du. Train depot 2. can't remember which one it's in. Oh, there we are. That's my express services in there. Got some HSCs, I've got some 47s. Now, somewhere else along the line, I did have, I'm sure, put some of the, uh, yeah. So that's got the 321s in it again, because the 321s will be the stalemate for, for all of this. So what we need to do, go to here. Shoop. Right. East Coast commuter right whoops a daisy okay now i just need to make sure this will play ball otherwise it's uh gonna get pretty awkward all right so it will just pick any random platform and then we need to go here all right let's make sure we're all good on that front e yep comes up from there 321 leaving okay right so we're gonna thunder along here then and hopefully it doesn't get any fancy ideas. Uh, right, Chester. And then... Ships and I'll store... Oh, that wasn't the SO2s. So that was the... That was the East Coast Main Line. 
because then you've got the uh have you oh hold on hold on hold on no ah you see no that's at least you know that works that's pretty cool all right let's get rid of ships and stalks that wasn't what i wanted i wanted ross on y but which ross on y is the commuter one it's this one now let's just make sure that when it comes to uh the track all as well looks good okay Right, up to Bedford. And then across to Pocklington. Then we have Camelford. Welling Garden City. Finally Hull. If I go back to Welling Garden City again. Uh, number two. Whoops, a daisy. Go away. Right, so it's station, so it's Welling Garden City. Just make sure that this all does add up quite nicely. Yep, Camelford. Uh, no, because those are not the right way. Let us try that one again. Actually, let's start from Hull. Let's go from Hull to there. Platform 2 is what I know. Hold on. I need it as platform 1 going in that other direction, coming up towards me. Do my signals agree? Yep, that's fine. So then it's Camelford, Bocklington, Bedford. Make sure I get to the right one for us on Y. Uh, right, then it's Chester. Uh, yeah, that makes sense for the moment. Right. South Woodham, Leighton Buzzard, right, South Woodham again, platform two, uh, right, so just make sure it's in coherence with my signals, yeah, right, so that was South Woodham Ferrers, right, then it's to Chester, oh, right, I have to wait for what I say here. For those who won't let me do anything. Got to wait. Got to wait for it, man. Come on. Right, then Ross on Y. Nope, it's gone and done that. Ross on Y platform 2. I really wish it would stop clicking onto that. Uh, right, let's just make sure that we've not got any fancy business going on with the points down here. Otherwise, uh, could be in a spot of... Bonver. Nope, we're good. Right. So that was Ross on Y, then up to Bedford, Bucklington, Camelford, Fenning Garden City. Uh, no, because Hull needs to be Hull needs to be platform two. Marvellous. Okay, right, that's the East Coast commuter. Right. New line. East, whoops a daisy, East, no, East Coast, whoop, no, Express, learn to spell, right, so, uh, let's go from, Start. let's start this one from Leighton Buzzard, right, Leighton Buzzard, and then it skims right through Chester, actually, its first stop is Ross on Y, so I've pretty much, ooh, blimey, okay, um, that's going to give real competition then to high speed one. You're definitely not stopping here, are you? No, you're definitely not stopping at Chester. No. Okay. Well, that's definitely going to give competition to Ross and Y then. All right. Runs through here. It must stop here then. Ah, oh, it does. Okay. It stops up here. It stops at Camelford. Straight through Welling Garden City into. Wow. There's hardly any stops on this run. Right, back to Camelford. Yep, that's all fine. Back to Rossom Y. Now I just want to make sure that there's no funny business with any points. What's going on? Oh no, the game's still running. Right, no funny business up here. Well, all the big points are there. That junction's fine. Runs up, goes under there. 
and into there. Okay, that's East Coast Express. That was uh, that was rather easy. Right, so I need to then go into Chester Train Depot 2. And I think it's... Which one was it? Was it this one? Yes, right. They go on East Coast Express. No. I'm not touching anything. I'm going to wait. It's having a think. There we are. Right, then I need to go to up here. Nope. 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 That's the one. East Coast Commuter. The condition of multiple vehicles is very poor. Okay, well, I can uh, work with this. Let's pause that, because I want to see the trains coming out of the depot. I want to Oh, okay, it's the, it's the buses. Alright, manage vehicles, replace. Um, there are Reaver buses, aren't they? So I need to go down. So let's just slow passengers, it's got to be easier. Right, you, you, a Reaver. Lovely. And that's just. There we go. South Woodham is a yellow bus, which I think is you. I trust it was you. Uh, no, it was a different bus. Okay, never mind. Uh, and this one is Milton Keynes. That is a... That's a blue one. And that is that one. Yes, right. Now, let's just do that. There was a 47 coming out. Solid blue with the Mark II set. Nice and slow to start with. DBSO on the rear. I know, okay, it's not prototypical of weapon of the East Coast Mainline, but I think it looks, looks cool. And it's heading off. Then who do we have following? It's another 47 coming out. That's absolutely fine. It's just like it's one of the large logo uh, 47s. There's the 321s coming up. That's now waiting in there for the lines to be cleared. So let's just run down here. I think these are all going through as doubles. And they're crossing over there. Oh, yes, I'm liking that. Crossing over. Excellent. Using the line. Yes, yes, yes. Right. Have we got the 47 now coming out from here? Just want to make sure this is this is the one. Yes, the large. Thank you very much. It's the large logo, so I think this might be the Mark One set. Now I didn't have much in the way of uh, variety in Mark One, so I've made this basically a solid. Um, second class train there's nothing wrong with that second class train for an express service why not It'd be cheaper for the passengers and I'll just make up a, a lie that there's some sort of um, trolley service taking place on this train okay as we find out who's next. Okay, it'll be the same again. And then if we go, you see there, the trains be diving under. Big fly up the big yeah, the, the archways there. I'm loving that. Okay, so um we're seeing as I wasted a lot of time for you guys just uh, rattling through what I was what I did. Let's whoops a daisy. Let's um plumb in the bus routes. And this, this will be a, a nice short one. Basically just a, a brief introduction to what I've been up to. And uh, then then we'll go from there. So um, what we'll do is we'll have a local bus route in Ash.
not actually, I'm not going to worry about putting in a, a fancy bus station because uh, it's not needed. Let's go with the glass roof. So we're going to want to go from here because the buses can just turn around. No, I tell you what, let's go with a standard bus station here because that can actually, that'll be absolutely fine. Something like that will do. And then I'll just do so many modded roads. I'm probably not ever going to use them. We'll just do something like that. Something like that. There we go. All right. So uh, they'll come out from down there to there to there to there to there to there, 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 and there. Okay, so we're going to get Ash, the Ash local set up. There we are, nice and simple, Ash local. And then we're going to do the same, whoops a daisy. We're going to do the same in Whitby, but Whitby's going to Whitby's actually growing quite exponentially. So Whitby's going to have to have like a, a, a bus thing. Really, I'm going to have to. I should have a bus station down here near the port. So I'm thinking, I do something like this. Has that got four? No, it's a four. I want two road. That's what. And bus, bus, bus. Big sort of through road bus station going down here. I'm sorry, people. Your houses will be going. Oh God, hello. What am I doing? Do you, you want to... In fact, does the game want to play ball? The game wants to freeze on you. That's what the game wants to do. Well, oh, that's nice of it. I'll be there. Oh, hello. Right. Let's let's kill that. Let's spin around because the game's having a bit of a hissy fit. Right, here we go. So, let's plumb that there. Yep, yeah, because you got connection to that. Okay, right, then... I kind of want to not get rid of people's houses. This... <laughs> that's just... That's going to be a bit odd, but there we are. Right. I'm just trying to think, when it comes to doing a Whitby train station, how are you going to do it? You're probably going to have to have one... If you're having the Riviera line, how are you going to do the Riviera line when it comes to you doing it? Well... Um, it's coming out, it was starting in Great Yarmouth, if memory serves. Let me have a quick check at the Great Yarmouth station. Yeah, see, so you've got a line coming out there, so you might have two Riviera lines working on this one. You might have a station there and a station. Hmm, okay. All right, well, we've got that through bus route anyway, so because I can use that as, like, X stops for like, the, the, big X, um, the, the, the bigger services. Do you want to have an evening off? Well, you've We've had an entire weekend to uh, work out we want to save the people. Right. This is... Tell you what, Whitby's going to get a really good bus service because I'm going to have this stopping pretty much everywhere at this point. Uh, let me go there. There. We then go there. We then go through here. Then there then here, and then there. Right, let's get the Whitby local going. Can you remember how you did this? Yes. Yes, there are no warnings, I know. Bang, 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 into there. Right, that's the Whitby local. And then what I'll do is I'll get all the buses sent out in one hit. Whitby local, because they can all access these towns from the various motorways. Uh, right, then I'm just going to whack in Berwick upon Tweed and Chester, and I'll then set up their X route at the same time. So uh, you're going to want a bus station down. No, you want a bus. You can actually just do bus stops. So you can all have bus stops in your bus station. Can be, uh, it can just be that one, a nice simple one. 
that can go that can actually go up here okay I'm gonna get rid of some industry but oh well I'm sure they'll live why do they keep clicking that I need to go on the bloody modern bus thingamabob right so we'll have that there and then there then there then there then it goes into there then we go there then there And then right there, 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 then there, then there, then there, then right across the train station. There we go. Right, this will be the wi the uh, the the Berwick on Tweed local. Let's call this the Berwick Low. Whoops, it is all capital at one. Locale. Okay. Whack in Chester's. Um, how are you going to have the buses stop in here? You can't configure this, can you? Or can you? I oh, see that's there. That doesn't help you. Because the vehicle's coming in. Well, you can actually, yeah. Yeah, we'll do that. We'll have that as... Have that as a big one. And then I suppose what you have to do, you're going to have to have some sort of service road going around the outside. Otherwise, that probably isn't going to work. So we'll do that. We'll do that as bus lane. Do something like that. Keep that as bus lane just for the buses to come around, then into... Yeah, okay, that's fine, because then the buses from Shipton upon Store can go in there as well. Right. Oh. Excellent. That's now waiting on the hill. I think I had about 20 of them come out here because of the length of the great e uh, the great um, bloody East Coast Main Line. That's the one you want, not the Great Eastern. The great Eastern's over there somewhere. Uh, right, who have we got down here? That's another 47 with a Mark II set. So they're coming out in staggered order, which is excellent. That's what I want. I don't want them all coming out in uh, basically the same. So you're going to want your bus station here. You're going to want something. You're going to want this. A big, a nice big large one. Okay, I know it's four lanes, but that sits there because that will have connectivity. It, these mods, interestingly, don't show the the, um, like the the connection to the town, whereas like the the in-game vanilla stuff does. These mods, however, I don't think they'll go down either. But they they do they do get used. I, I assure you, it's the same with uh, with this one. I think, yeah, so they, they they don't really work. And then when you go to these modern bus stops, all is absolutely well. So it's a, it's an interesting one. So anyway, we go there, uh, here, here. Uh, you've then got that there. So do you want to have just a standard? Oh no, because you can utilise one of these again. Because yeah, because then you can have. No, you can't. Or can you actually do something like? that something like that could work yep and then you have the road do something like that yep and then that'll just go into there yep that's fine right back to the buildings bus stop Right, so then we go to here, here, here. Uh, then we want to go there, 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 there.
Yep, because you want to go there. Stick another one there. Two like that. Up to there and back in. Let's just make sure I can get this to work now. So I'm going to start from here. Then there. 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 You. 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 Right, how's this going to work? Then you. Yep, that's exactly what I want. Jolly good. And then back joins to there. That joins to there. Uh, have No, because that's got two stops. That's fine, because that then goes to there. Okay, so that's the chest uh, local. Okay, and then I just want to set up like a, a, a just a, a an express bus route. So... Uh, Lower Chester to the top end of Berwick, and that could be X1. Something nice and simple. Right, back down here to the depot, because this is going to be utilised by absolutely everything. Okay, you're going to want different buses for different roles here, so five vehicles. Passenger, yep. Right, you've got the big bus, Euro lines, one. One of those on the X1. Okay, right, then you're going to go for these um, these bendy buses. You're going to go for 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. You're going to go 10 of them. You're going to paint them purple. No. You're going to paint them dark blue. Yes. That is going to go on the Whitby local because Whitby is such a big town. Not responding once again. There we go, just made the sound. Right, then I want to go back to these buses, and we're going to have... Um, we're going to go to Reaver again. One, two, three, four. We're going to have uh, five of them on the Ash local. And then we're going to go up here to the Solarius Urbans. We're going to have Hybrid. We're going to have one, two, three, four, five. We can go on the Berwick local. And then, let's just see what, oh hello, we've got industrial being built there. It's the Chester local I'm missing now, so we'll go into there, buy vehicles, go double-decker bus, we're going to go, um, we're going to go, we'll go coastliner, even though we're nowhere near the coast, one, two, three, four, five, ten, because Chester will get busy, ten of those on the Chester local. Okay, right, let's just do that, make sure everybody's singing, yep, everyone's good, every single line's making a loss in the bus department, in fact, every line in general is making a loss, with the exception of the latest bus, bus service, good! Right, once that's done, yeah, you, that, that little gap, you want to fill it, yep, a little bit more, in front of the mouse, come on, come on, follow, yes, a bit more, Come on. You can do it. I have faith in you. I'll wait. I'll drink my coffee while I'm waiting. No, I don't care. Of course, it finishes while I'm mid-gulp. Okay, so we've got our buses going. Uh, what do you want? You want tools. That's fine. I, want, I do need to start utilising some freight at some stage. Because see here, we've now got passengers waiting here. Oh, hello, let's go down for a, a passing shot coming past. Diesel running under the wires. Excellent. Right, who have we got anything else going? We've got, who are you? You look like a HST. I will happily take that. Happily, happily, happily. And then Chester will become a hive of activity of all the trains that will be coming and going. Uh, so, yep, that's good. We've now got all the buses going. Right, so, um, what I will do, I will get, like, bus services doing, like, X2s covering all of these. So the buses are, are then linked, like, with, with all of these, you know, X3, X4, stuff like that. 
mean, look at Whitby. Look, Whitby is a big town already, and it's got it's already got people waiting for the buses. It's got plenty of people waiting for the port. You know what? I when it comes to Whitby, I'm thinking there's going to be a I'm going to plumb it in now. Whitby can have a regional airport. When it comes to me doing my airlines, um, I've got an interesting system that I always use in all of my playthroughs I do in this game, and I hope you will all like it as well. Okay. Uh, two terminals. Right. Will this mod work on this part of Whitby? No, this is too big. What if you did something like this? Yeah. Mind you, how close are you to... When, it doesn't matter how close I am to there, because I can have planes take off from here, do loops around, and then come into uh, Leighton Buzzard. Yeah, we'll do it. Because, do you want to be clever? Yes, I do. Uh, let's go with... Yeah, let's just, just do, let's just do that. Right, where's... That is all there. Okay, so if you bring this in... Can't change my landing direction. That's a shame. Um, okay. Well, if you actually... If you just did something like... Keep bringing it down... Up, 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 across. Okay, you do something like that. Yeah. Then, I plumb in a road. Where's the... Is it? Is there actually the main station entrance? Oh, okay, it doesn't make much of a difference. It all, it all latches on. Right, do something like that, because that all connects. How low is that? It's quite low. So if I then came off here to the spur and did that, yep, okay, that's now connected. So if I click this, bearing in mind we had all the industry here, okay? So let's go. Hmm, that's quite depressing. Um, here. All right, <laughs> that's not really what I had in mind. All right. Well, there's no harm in trying. What if we did something like that then? If we had it connected to there, suddenly we're, we're, we're already better. So that, what does that give me? Let's just go into buildings. That will give me fuel for some of it. No, okay, I'll have to keep that as a passenger airport and I'll have to have my industry trucks coming in for all of that business. Okay, we've got all of our buses going. Hey, we've got buses using the motorway. Yeah, boy. Okay, we are golden. We've got we've got the East Coast Mainline up and running. We've got our buses now going through the local area. Uh, the next episode, I want to try and... I don't know how long this has been, but I, want to, I don't want to do it too long. Um, next episode, we'll get the Great Eastern. Um, we'll get the, the Great Eastern branch uh, sorted. So we'll do like the um, we'll call it the Waltham Cross branch. No, because that's the that's the big bulk arm of it. Yeah. All right. Well, that's going to be that anyway. We'll um, we'll get that sorted and we'll get some more buses. Uh, we'll get some more buses going. And tell what I'm actually going to do off camera. I'm just going to set up the the intercity bus services, and I'm going to do um, the. All, I'm actually going to do all the buses uh, for this this section of land. So all the buses in here, I'm going to do off camera. What I will do on camera is the Cardiff Valley Tram. So going from Hull, the Hatfield, Stourbridge, Derby, Cardiff into Welling Garden City, back into Hatfield, boom. Oh no, into Welling Garden City, then back down. Yeah, so that's the. The Cardiff Valley Tram will do on camera. I'm going to do all the buses off camera. But the next episode, we are going to get the Great Eastern, uh, the, the main branch of the Great Eastern sorted. Uh, and then we'll go from there. So, thank you all very much for watching. It is greatly appreciated. If you have enjoyed what you've seen today, please do like and subscribe. Feel free to leave a comment. I do come back to them as and when I get the opportunity to. So, we are going to stop off in Whitby. 
And we're going to find out who wants to go and say goodbye. Who wants to say Toodle Pip from Wem- Whitby? And it's the Wembley then. Oh, our buses are in. Okay, let's go. Right. Uh, Megan Patel, Katie Hall, Lewis Anderson, Isabel Wood, who can't drive. Uh, Patel's having a bit of a moment here. And a fire hydrant. Excellent. And uh, who are you? Eliza Thomas. Excellent. So, from me and everybody else here in the beautiful city of Whitby, I shall see you all later. Take care, guys. Goodbye.